this thing I want to kind of <clears throat> talk about and show you is how to change the ratios on the gears. This basically the switch has uh, two speeds. There's a one and two, the forward reverse. But you can change the speeds and make these faster or slower based on the gear configuration. So basically what I was wanting to do, I, I want to speed up my ripping a little bit. Um, right now I'm on uh, 10, what, 10.5 and 20.6 feet per minute. Um, I want to step that up and I thought I would just show you how I'm going to do that and change the gearing in the Felder S308 feeder. All right, what I did when I got this, I went ahead and marked the gears. So basically, on the side of the feeder, it has the, all these different ratios you can set up for the gearing and how many feet per minute in position one and position two. And the diagram on the side shows you position A, B, C, and D. So basically, what you do is these numbers here are how many teeth are on the gears, okay? So if you want 8.3 for setting one, then you need to put the gears in these following spots. So first thing you do, I'll take the cover off. All right, and there's kind of a closer picture of what I'm talking about on the panel. So I'm gonna be setting this up to 27 and 54, okay? So what I did when I first got the machine, I went ahead and wrote with a, a marker how many teeth these gears have, you know, so it'll make it easier on me. So that's 43, 22, that's 40, that's 25. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna loosen this up. Take these and lock washers off. And take this one off. All right. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead take the gears out and also the A, B, C, and D kind of give you indication of oh, that one's not coming out let's see if I can gently nudge it And I've never taken these out before. This is the way it came from the factory. Let me wiggle it. Pretty tight on that keyway. All right. So now I'm just going to go through A, B, C, D. Okay. So now position A it says put the 40 tooth. Okay. So in position A, I'm going to put the 40 tooth right here. Okay. Position B wants me to put the 25 tooth. So we'll go here to position B. Run that gear and that cog. Wow, that's pretty tight. See if it'll wiggle. There we go. C goes on top of B, so it shows you right here. C on top of B. 
So C is 22 teeth. We'll put that there. And then the last one, position D, and I got it right here, it's the 43 teeth. Okay. There's another video when I was feeding the ripped lumber in here, and you can see the speed of it in there. All right, there we go. Tighten that down. Put that in there. You don't have to gorilla glue it. Just kind of always slightly, a little more in snug. That's good. All right. I would suggest you run this without the cover on, but that's basically it. So you won't be able to tell the difference until I actually start uh, feeding some new lumber through here. That's it. So I'll make a video uh, ripping wood with these uh, new speeds. And I already made videos on the slower speed. And that's it. That's all it is to changing the gears on the uh, Felder feeder. Right here, let's hold it up against the fence. But it is back.